Today's Kids Can Paint project will be this cute and adorable mushroom from Super Mario Brothers. We'll be painting on a 10 by 10 inch canvas using acrylic paints. Simply follow the link in the description box below to download today's free traceable, gather your paints and materials, and then have your child or student follow along with this step-by-step -step video as I teach them how to paint. We're going to begin by transferring our traceable image to our canvas using a sheet of carbon or graphite paper. You can find carbon paper at your local office supply store or by using the affiliate link below. Center your stencil on your canvas and then tape the sheet of carbon paper shiny side down behind it. Then take a basic ballpoint pen and begin tracing around the image. You want to press firmly, but not so much as to tear the paper or damage the canvas beneath. Carefully peel off the carbon paper and the stencil. Your canvas should look like this. Now let's start painting. For today's painting, I'll be using the colors white, light peach, bright red, bright blue, and black. Take an angled brush, dip it in the white paint, and then carefully fill in the center circle and the two side ovals. Using the same brush, fill in the face with light peach. Be extra careful around the eyes. You can switch to a smaller brush if you like. Next, take a clean flat brush and load it with bright red. Begin filling in the mushroom cap. I like to fill in all the big spots first, then go back and take my time around the edges. Again, you can always switch to a smaller brush for these narrow areas. Step back and take a look at what you've done. It's looking good so far. Take another clean angled brush and begin filling in all the large areas around the mushroom with bright blue. This is the background. Make sure to get the top, bottom, and sides of your canvas too. Now carefully fill in the white gaps around the mushroom. Take your time and turn the canvas around to face you if needed. Next, we're going to go in with the black using a small, thin, angled brush. Let's start by filling in the blank line around the mushroom's face. Now, there's no line above the face, so we're just going to make our own. Try to keep it as wide as the line below. Now let's draw a black line around the whole mushroom cap as well as the two side ovals.
finally, let's trace that big center circle. And don't forget the eyes. Fill those in too. Now you can stop right there and be done with your painting, but if you want your mushroom to look a little more animated, take the back end of a thin paintbrush and dip it into some white paint. Then carefully tap the end of that brush near the top of each eye to give your little guy a pupil. Looks better, right? Now don't forget to sign your painting and add the year so you'll always remember when you created it. Step back and take a look at what you've accomplished. Wasn't that easy? See, you can paint anything as long as you break it down into steps. And here's our toadstool painting hanging on a wall. Doesn't he look great? 